family, this week we're sharing on the topic heaven on earth, experiencing heaven whilst on earth. And the scripture I would love to focus on is Matthew chapter 6 verse 10. In Matthew chapter 6 verse 5 to 10, Jesus teaches his disciples on how to pray. And in verse 10 he says this, Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. In this prayer we see two main points, which is your kingdom come. Kingdom comprises of two words, a king and a domain, meaning a territory that is ruled by a sovereign or a king. So the kingdom of God is a rulership of God over our lives. But we know according to Luke chapter 17 verse 21 that the kingdom of God is already within us. And so the kingdom of God is simply the rulership of God over our hearts. The first key to be able to experience heaven on earth is for us to give our hearts over to the rulership of the Lord Jesus Christ. The second point I would love to to share with you is is your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. The will of God has already been established in heaven. It is a done deal, but what is left with is for us to be able to see it manifest in our lives. It's for us to experience it here on earth. The will of God has already been established in his word, but we we need to experience it in our day-to-day life. And I would love to quote this scripture in Romans chapter 14, verse 17, the Bible says, For the kingdom of God is not eating and drinking, but righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Spirit. One of the benefits of heaven, according to Revelation chapter 21, verse 4, is that Jesus will wipe away every tear from our eyes, meaning we will have joy unspeakable. And so we can experience the joy of God while still on this earth. Regardless of whatever is happening around us, we can still experience joy on this earth. According to Galatians chapter 5, verse 22, the Bible says that the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, and peace. You can experience joy here on earth, regardless of the circumstances that you face, because the joy of God is living in the inside of us. The kingdom of God is in the inside of us. I want to encourage you today, go out there and experience the joy of the Lord. You are highly favored and deeply loved of God.